Well, the most wonderful time of the year deserves the most wonderful food. Joining us now to help us prepare a festive feast for your family and friends is Chef Jonathan Collins. How are you doing this morning, Jonathan? Good Great. to see you, my friend. Good to see you, Okay, too. let's start where you're doing here with so the rolls. Right now, I'm just going to prep some of these Collins family dinner rolls. Mm -hmm. A little bit of olive oil, and I'm just going to add a little bit of fresh thyme all over the top of it. Now, we've got a complete feast here. Though. Right, uh, absolutely. We've got turkey. Right. We've got a vegetarian side. Right. But let's go to the stuffing. Let's start with the stuffing. I've got okay. carrots. Celery, onion, and leek, saute to golden perfection. Now I've got a little bit of Pinot Grigio. So I'm going to use this to deglaze. This is uh, Santa Margherita. This is uh, a beautiful Italian. We're using it to deglaze. Deglaze. So all of that flavor that's Because usually we have it deglaze over your eyes. That's but we're right. using it. Okay, there yeah. you go. You can, you can, and that's, you bring up a good point in your facetious uh, <laughs> yes, little yes, comment. Yes, yes. Is that you should be drinking as good a wine as you're cooking as you're with. Cooking. Well, there's Absolutely. a good point. So you want to, you want to uh, reduce that completely. But this is where, now I've got a nice heavy sourdough right and as that reduces I'm gonna put that sourdough directly in Wow and it's gonna mop up all of that goodness and how soon in advance should we be doing this this should be done if you can do this the day before right. you're way ahead this part of it and okay. I'll tell you why it's really important to be safe with the temperature of stuffing stuffing needs to be below four degrees before it ever goes near the turkey. right so again don't don't put hot stuffing right into the turkey exactly okay so now to go along with that stuffing I've got some beautiful sausage here I've removed it from the casing mm -hmm. and I'm gonna take and I'm gonna put some of the bread in with that as oh, well okay so again Beauty. all of that beautiful pork fat goodness is going to be soaked up by the bread. I'll mix those together and I end up with a beautiful stuffing. Okay, now, I heard Pinot Grigio gravy. Gravy. So what I've done is I've roasted onions mm -hmm. and I've also got a heavy amount of sage in there. You can see that. Okay, yeah. Now I've added, uh, I've actually added a whole bottle of Pinot Grigio. Okay, well, you So know, we're going to reduce that. Go. Yes. We're going to reduce that and what that does is all of the character of that Pinot Grigio, mm -hmm. uh, the aging is going to reduce and give that that extra layer of uh, flavor. And did you throw the giblets in there as well? The giblets are yeah. in there. Right, okay. And now, I, now I've got all the drippings from my beautiful turkey. Right. And I wouldn't dare waste any of those. Those I put in there as well. Then uh, exactly. put it through a fine sieve. Okay, let's get to the turkeys. We've okay. only got a little bit of time left. Yes. So, this is your traditional turkey. Yeah, traditional turkey, and I'm calling it a paysan, which is peasant. The, the thing about turkey is there's so much fear about it. The important thing is cook a turkey that's fully defawed, and make sure you cook it to 165 degrees internal temperature. Use okay. a probe thermometer. Fresh or make frozen. It easy. Fresh or frozen. Fresh or frozen doesn't matter. You get great quality either way. And you have a vegetarian option. Now, just if we can just if, just get a shot of this, I want people at home to quickly decide what that is. That's your vegetarian turkey option. Do you know what that is? That is a cal uh, cauliflower roast. A cauliflower, cauliflower roast. Yep. And it's got a tomato gravy. I'm telling you, if, you, if you're not into turkey, this wow. will not leave you wanting. All right, there you go. Nice, nice, nice. Jonathan Collins, appreciate it. Uh, Merry Christmas. Happy holidays Thank to you, you, my friend. Very there good. we go. All Thank right. You. You'll find uh, our recipes today on the website.